Hello YouTube, Dave here again. Uh, just going to be a quick video. I'm just going to open up some packs from the uh, the cons of uh, Tarkir uh, fat pack that I just unboxed in the previous video. So these are the five uh, boosters that I have here that I'm going to actually open. I've got the three set aside that I'm going to keep sealed and I've got the one set aside uh, that's going to be part of a giveaway uh, once I reach 500 subscribers. Uh, if you didn't see the last video, just kind of check that out. It's towards the end where I kind of described. Uh, they don't have the actual contest details yet, but uh, check that out and uh, keep an eye out for, for when uh, the contest will occur. But for now, let's just uh, let's get started. So uh, I'm not, uh, not really proficient at this, so there's probably some techniques that I'm not 100% aware of. Uh, I'm also not aware of the ordering that they put the cards in, so if it's like commons, uncommons, and the rares in the back, or if it's it's kind of scattered. So um, unless they're they're marked, I'm not even gonna be sure if I got the rare or, or what it is that's in here. So, but we'll take a look and see. Uh, if you're watching this, you probably know more about magic than I do. I'm looking to get more into it, but uh, you can certainly let me know uh, if, if there are some good cards in here or not. So we'll get the, uh, the first pack underway. Okay. All right, and on the back here, looks like just some sort of, this must be some sort of promo. Just showing up as a, uh, as a morph card. But anyway, let's just set that aside. Set the wrapper aside. And uh, here. See if I get that to adjust. Doesn't look like it's going to. Let's just zoom back out. All right. So the uh, the first card here, uh, Trumpet Blast. Uh, instant attacking creature gets plus two plus zero until the end of your turn. Uh, Enoch Bond Kin. Again, I apologize that it's not uh, showing up too clearly on here. Uh, Whirlwind Adept, which is a blue card. Really hoping that the cards would focus, but or the uh, it would focus on the cards, but uh, I guess it's not going to do that anyway. Uh, Mardu War Shrieker, <clears throat> Orc Shaman, three three uh, raid when enters battlefield. If you attacked with a creature this turn, you add uh, one red, one white, or one black to your mana pool. I don't know if it's one of each or you choose, but there you go. Uh, feed the clan, gain five life. Uh, ferocious, you gain 10 life instead if you control a creature with a power of 4 or greater. Uh, debilitating Injury, Enchant uh, Creature gets negative 2, negative 2. Rakshasa Secret, uh, target opponent discards 2 cards, put the top 2 cards of your library into your graveyard. Uh, Ponyback Brigade, requires a red, white, and black mana. Uh, it's a 2-2. Morph. It's got a few different abilities there. I'll have to read them a little more closely later. Uh, long Shot Squad. 3-3 uh, three, three creature. Outlast. Again, there's a lot of abilities I'm not really familiar with. but And it looks like a white and green. Uh, land. Blossoming Sands. Enters tapped. Uh, when it gains, or when it enters, gain one life. And you can add a green or a white to your mana pool. Uh, Venerable... Lamassu, 5 4 flying. Uh, carnal, or sorry, Cranial Archive, artifact. Exile Cranial Archive. Target player shuffles his or her graveyard into his or her library draw card. <clears throat> High Spire Mantis. Flying Trample, 3 3. Uh, flooded Strand, which is a. Uh, so you pay one life, sacrifice Flooded Strand, search your library for a Plains or Island card, put it into the battlefield, then shuffle your library. So, there's that, and just a Red Mountain. Well, that was the <coughs> first pack. Second one with the female warrior on it. So I probably won't go into describing the abilities, I'll just give the name. Because again, you pr probably know more about it than I will. So, just another <coughs> promo card with the morph there. 
Oh, I think it's a promo card. I'll probably get corrected, but... Uh, so, <clears throat> we got uh, Weave Fate. Trumpet Blast. Salt Road Patrol. Disdainful Stroke. Smoke Teller. Uh, Sadissi's Pet. Zombie Ape. 1-4. Another Longshot Squad. Uh, another Blossoming Sands. Throttle. Creature gets negative 4, negative 4. Scout the Borders. Brave the Sands. Swarm of Bloodflies. Uh, Timur Charger. T-E-M-U-R. Iron Tusk Fortress. Requires white Black and green. That's 5 7. And a plane. Just regular white land. Next one. Looks like a female uh, mage of some sort, I guess. Probably not quite the same types of concepts as DD, but I guess I just kind of think of them in DD terms. That's just a uh, thing for the 2015 set. Okay. <clears throat> so, Glacial Stalker. Shatter. Destroy target artifact. Uh, Firehoof Calvary. Wetlands Sambar. Savage Punch. Debilitating Injury. So we've already seen that one before, too. Uh, Jungle Hollow. So it's either black or green. Highland Game, a 2-1. Abzan Guide, a 4-4 Human Warrior. Looks like a few different abilities there. I'll have to definitely look into that. Uh, another Lamassu, 5-4. Uh, Abzan Falconer. Windstorm deals X damage to each creature with flying. Uh, Jeskai Ascendancy. Requires blue, red, and white. Oh, and, uh, huh. I never actually realized that magic did this, but it uh, looks like a holographic card. Uh, it is a rare. I think that's what the R at the bottom there stands for. Mind Sweep. Instant. Counter target spell, unless its controller pays X. <clears throat> Mind Sweep deals X damage to that spell's controller. And a forest, so just a green land. So it looks like each pack seems to have uh, one land at the end. And uh, it's kind of cool. Holographic card. Next one here. Oh, and snake. Oh, maybe these are for, uh, for tokens. I'll have to, again, hopefully somebody will let me know in the in the comments. I guess I can go online and look it up as well. Uh, so, Enoch Bond Kin, 2-1. Whirlwind Adept. Mardu War Shrieker, it's an orc. Kind of like the way that the orcs look in the, in the artwork that I've seen so far. Feed the Clan, gain 5 life. Uh, I think we've already seen this one as well. Debilitating Injury. Bloodfell Caves is a black or red mana. Uh... Alabaster, was it Kier, Kieran? Flying Vigilance 2 3. Abomination of Gadul. Requires black, green, and blue, as well as three colorless. Mystic of the Hidden Way, 3 2. Monk. A Yeti, Summit Prowler. Pretty cool. Mistfire Weaver. Abs and uh, Falconer, so another one of those. Uh, murderous Cut. Destroy target creature. Oh, and a Planeswalker. So, Shark and the Dragon Speaker. Uh, I don't really know much about Planeswalkers at all. Uh, so I definitely want to look into this and see hopefully if this is a good one or not. And a Swamp. Okay, and the last one. Oh, all right. There we go. And this one has a spirit warrior, so token creature, token creature. Maybe that must be what it's for. 
I don't know. Salt Road Patrol. Uh, Human Scout, 2-5. Wow. That's quite a lot of defense. It's, uh, Scaldkin, 2-2. Two, two, elemental. Aerostorm. Deals 4 damage to target creature or player. Raid. If you attack with a creature this turn, instead Aerostorm deals 5 damage to that creature or player and the damage can't be prevented. Debilitating Injury. Uh, Smoke Teller Siegecraft. <clears throat> Enchanted Creature gets 2, plus 2, plus 4. Wow. <clears throat> Teamer Banner. Add uh, green, blue, or red mana to your pool. Uh, sacrifice, or you can <clears throat> spend one of each. Tap this, sacrifice it, draw a card. Uh, Singing Bell Strike. Bloodfire Mentor. Uh, Nefrit Shaman, 0-5. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, Scoured Barons, either white or black mana. Hordling Outburst. Uh, put three 1-1 one, one red goblin creature tokens on the battlefield. Kind of cool. Uh, Ruthless Ripper. Human Assassin, 1-1. One, one. Tomb of the Spirit Dragon. You can tap it to add one to your mana pool. Uh, looks like the rare flying crane technique. Untap all creatures you control. They gain flying and double strike until the end of turn. And a mountain. So those were the cards that I got in the uh, in the boosters that I opened up. Again, the other ones are going to stay uh, sealed. Just for collector purposes. Um, I might eventually decide to say screw that and open them. But at this point, they're going to stay like that. And uh, there's 80 cards, <clears throat> which is just basic land. Uh, so there's going to be, I guess, a bunch of all the different types in there. So that's the, uh, that's the, I guess, the unboxing, the complete unboxing for this uh, Cons of Tarkir uh, fat pack. Uh, I think the highlight for me is this, this holographic card. I didn't even know that Magic did holographic cards. Uh, I guess I really am out of touch with it, but this seems pretty cool. I'm going to start looking these over and uh, hopefully eventually figure out what they actually all do. And, uh, you know, it might be kind of fun to get back into actually actually playing this. So... We'll, uh, we'll see what happens, but for now, I guess it's just going to go in the collection. Pretty cool. I uh, hope you enjoyed these videos. Uh, if there's any particularly good cards or anything that you want to let me know about some of the abilities, uh, certainly feel free to post that in the comments below. It would help quite a bit versus me trying to figure it out on my own. But I hope you enjoyed these, uh, these videos, and uh, I guess we'll see you next week. In the meantime, uh, I know Christmas is coming up uh, if you're watching this when it posts, so if you are, I hope all of you that are watching, have a great holiday season, and uh, I'll see you next week. Thank you.